This video demonstrates how to perform a basic search in the library catalog. Starting from the library homepage, click on the library catalog link. The library catalog will then open in a new window. In the text box, you can type a word or phrase. The default search is set to words or phrase, which means that the catalog will search for the exact word or words that you type in the text box. By clicking the down arrow next to words or phrase, you can choose to search for a specific author, title, subject, series, or periodical title. For this search, I'm going to leave it at words or phrase. I am going to search for records in the catalog that mention comic books. I will type comic books in the text box and then click the search button. This particular search retrieved 38 titles. There are navigation links at the top and the bottom of the results list. This will allow you to see the next page of results. Each entry in the results list includes several pieces of information about the item. You should see the title, author, call number, a note about item availability, the item's location, and the publication date. If an item is checked out, there will be a note stating the estimated wait until the item is due. Otherwise, if the item is checked in, the note will say that it is available. In order to locate the item in the library, you will need both the call number and the location. You can click on the title of any of the items in the results list to see more information about that title. Notice that the call number and the location are now found at the bottom of this next screen. To see even more information about a title, click on the blue catalog record link. Scroll down and look for contents or an abstract. In some instances there may not be very much information, but in most cases you will see chapter titles or a few sentences describing the contents of the item. To go back to the results list, scroll to the top of the screen and click on Go Back. To start over completely, click on New Search. If you have any questions or need additional help, please do not hesitate to contact the library.